The F-35 Lightning II gives the U.S. and its coalition partners a joint strike fighter with lethal capabilities. This fifth-generation aircraft draws on highly advanced stealth, avionics, and weapons technology to face the challenges of the 21st century. The F-35 is going to be the backbone of the entire fighter fleet for the United States Air Force and for all our partner nations. We're going to have more F-35s in the world than any other fighter platform. And all the training starts right here at Luke Air Force Base. Preparing pilots to fly and employ this weapon system is the mission of the 56th Fighter Wing and its F-35 Academic Training Center. The Academic Training Center is a state-of-the-art facility that offers its students a dynamic and realistic learning environment. The combat flight line of the future is going to start here in the ATC. From the United States Air Force, we're going to have students who transition from other airframes, whether that be the A-10, the F-16, or the F-15. We'll have students who will come here right out of undergraduate pilot training, and then we'll have eight partner countries and three and four military sale countries uh, training here in the ATC. The 145,000 square foot building features a 240 seat auditorium as well as 12 classrooms. The electronic media lecture, or EML classrooms, include desktop stations with hands-on throttle and stick controls. Lessons in these classrooms are guided by an instructor. In the interactive courseware, or ICW classrooms, students work through interactive lesson plans. The ATC is a building block approach where we take a student that is completely unfamiliar with the F-35 program and we build into systems understanding, then introduce tactics as well as some of the execution pieces in a controlled environment from a computer-based training into a simulator-based training. The facility also includes learning centers and lounge areas for courseware review and self-paced study. But the focal point of the academic training center is its classified simulator base. So we've got 12 simulator bays, outfit to operate as a single entity as well as linked together to make a two-ship or four-ship operation. With its cockpit and near 360-degree dome structure, the simulator provides a realistic representation of the aircraft and allows students to apply what they've learned in the classroom. Instructors monitor the students during the simulated flight in real time from outside the simulator bay. Pre-flight and post-flight briefing rooms allow for immediate review of the simulated flight. Students complete five to six weeks of their initial course at the ATC before they go to one of the flying squadrons at Luke to continue training in the seat of an F-35. But the academic training isn't over. While they're in the airplane flying, they will continue to come back here for simulators and academics and advanced systems and advanced weapons until they graduate. The Academic Training Center continues the Luke Air Force Base legacy of training the world's greatest F-35 pilots so the U.S. and coalition partners can rely on the F-35 to help provide security and air superiority for years to come.